Sitting at home alone, Jeff Willis wonders when he will next see the woman he married in 2002. My wife is not a spy. My wife is not a thief. She's not a criminal. My wife is a hardworking businesswoman who has spent years working on any kind of things that can help create cooperation between Houston and China. Since Sandy Fon Gillis was detained in China six months ago, Gillis has spoken only to his sisters, his wife's family, and close friends, hoping that U.S. officials could negotiate her release. Now he's publicly asking President Obama to bring the case up with the Chinese leader when they meet Friday. Although he's hired lawyers, Gillis says it's been difficult to get any information from her or about her. I am able to communicate through uh, only through the U.S. consulate in Guangzhou. No family is able to talk to her or friends or even her lawyers. In the latest meeting on September 23rd, Sandy sent a message to her husband, part of which reads, This is a political case. I hope you can lobby for an exchange of political prisoners. I know it's not easy. The U.S. has raised the case with the Chinese government, according to U.S. State Department spokesman Mark Toner. Uh, we obviously uh, are monitoring this case very closely. Uh, we've been to visit her uh, six times since her arrest. And uh, we've raised her case with Chinese uh, government officials on multiple occasions uh, at a very senior level. The arrest of Sandy Pham Gillis has come as a shock to people in both Houston's Vietnamese and Chinese communities. Although she is of Chinese descent, she was born in Vietnam and came here from that country as a refugee 40 years ago. Over the years, many businesses here have developed relationships with Chinese firms, but the arrest of Phan Gillis makes some uneasy. I have heard of many local Chinese who have not gone back to China since Sandy was detained because they're afraid. And Gillis says he's afraid if she is not freed within a few weeks, he may not see his wife for years, if ever. Greg Flakus, VOA News, Houston.